Here we go, guys. Life is Strange, episode one. Life is Strange is a story-based game that features player choice. The consequences of all your in-game actions and decisions will impact the past, present, and future. Choose wisely. Hi, Fungus. Hi, Pimmy. <gasps> is it loud? Or not, not loud enough. So surreal. Famously called film, little pieces of time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay, I'm These in class. Everything's cool. Story. I am okay. From light to shadow, from color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in I black and white? I didn't fall asleep, and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Did you just say Diane Bueller? Arbus? There you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. Because of her images of hopeless faces, you feel like totally haunted by the eyes of the I can't believe I still have this pencil case. She I should upgrade to the 21st right? century. Frankly, I do love my analog camera. I should take a quick picture now. <laughs> Seriously, though. I could frame it's any so one of you in a dark corner Class. and capture you in a moment of death. Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. <laughs> a dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular oh, since the early 1800s. The other stuff. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? I did know, but I kind of forgot. You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. <laughs> okay. Back the daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces. I haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. From the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was- Look at this crap. Done by Robert How can Williams? I show this to Mr. Jefferson? You can find out I can hear the class laughing at me now. Textbook. Or even 
on Damn one. It. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. We have a lot of stuff to look at. <sighs> Even her school books are gift wrapped. I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What is she, 15 years old? Of course, Victoria has to have the bestest, newest, most. I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. $5,300 camera. That was amazing when Mr. Jefferson took a class picture the first week. Even though I didn't want to be in the picture at all, it was fairly fucking cool to watch him at work framing us. I love seeing Mr. Jefferson's awesome photos on these magazine covers. That printer is amazing. I'd love to see how it reproduces my pictures. I could pump out a whole gallery show with that thing. Looks like somebody was already working on this. Cool. What do you mean, Jesus poop? Fungus. Now I wish I wouldn't have read this. <laughs> Purge. Rachel. Huh, this might make a cool shot. In Amber forever. This is definitely where cameras go to heaven. So cool to see Mr. Jefferson's actual published pictures. Gives me hope. Even in pictures, the forest around here always looks mysterious. You can never escape the lighthouse here. I'm glad the conversation keeps going, even if you back out. <laughs> Whoa, Mr. Jefferson is not messing around with that monster. He probably paid 20 grand for that camera. I bet he gets pristine digital images. But I still... Man, he even has the best plasma HGTV for a class monitor. Here's the poster for the contest. Mr. Jefferson really expects me to enter. Why? I don't know if I'm ready for my 15 minutes of infamy. Hi, Kate. Oh. Hi, Max. You seem quiet today. Just thinking too much. Victoria has already won. I hear that. Wanna go grab a cup of tea and bitch about life? Thanks, but not today. I have to go over homework. No worries. Let's hang later. Sure. Okay, I guess we need to find out what she'd say about her. Kate looks so sad and quiet today. Poor thing. Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. This is ridiculous. I always get so shy and nervous around Mr. Jefferson. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I, I talk to you for a moment? You're yes. Freezing. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Is it already time for her hot chocolate? I didn't have any time. Way too much homework. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. The courage to share it with others? So cool that we can check these out anytime. The Decisive Moment by Henri Cartier-Bresson, that's rare. 
any leap of its mad respect. You didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about the to. Galleries. You always Welcome to the real world. Just cute. Hot. Hot. Then I might yeah. send you a special picture of chocolate. I'll just use. I'll get the. Um, to see how you Did you play Lord Kelly? I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Only use like half of it. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. It's not quite as cute. I hate that class. It's so fucking boring. It gets the job done. She's so fucking shy. She takes selfies with a giant camera. Evan doesn't say much to me, but his photos are very cool. To all of you, That's Dana talking American to, I think his name is Justin. To imagine a world Stella is always you. deep in her notes. American she didn't come to Blackwell to mess around. Like to I've seen Brooke hanging out with Warren. She seems like his type. Driving a car I hate bully jockstraps like Logan. And he's a Vortex Club member. It looks like she's been gone from Rachel. Once. A PC, missed the poetry jam tryouts, and I did not steal that backpack. American That's so messed up. I should contact them to find out what I can do. No Thanks for if I am. Master volume. Let me know how that is. Is that any better? Good thing I left my egg here. Uh, I can turn it down I more, just let me know. They should just call it a sugar machine. That would be awesome if you put money in there and you can never have enough ghosts and skeletons in the hall. Almost Halloween. Just like here. Well, they're probably closer to Halloween. There's Hayden, another Vortex Club bro, but he's actually not an ass. Figures Juliet would be dating Zachary, jocks sucked up in the Vortex Club. Nerd alert, this poster has Warren written all over it. Empty, good. Nobody can see my meltdown, except for me. Game's still pretty loud. Okay, no worries. We can even turn the music specifically down a bit if that helps. All right. Well, let me know again once you can hear stuff. If it's still okay. Thanks for telling me. Now who would bother to write that crap? So now, is her voice too low? I remember when somebody punked the alarm last month. At least I got out of science class for that. I'm good to flow. <laughs> Thanks. This poster must drive people <laughs> to have sex. Are we gonna have to draw anywhere? Maybe not yet. Oh yeah, subtitles. Thanks, forgot. Oh, subtitle size, yes. I mean, subtitles, yes. Subtitle size, large. I don't mind turning it back up again. It's a little low for me now.
Hi. Hey, Alice. Hope you're having a good day at work. Your chat and video freezes. Oh, man. What else are we supposed to do in here? Great. Escape. The last time I got a flu shot, <laughs> I got the flu. Fuck oh, here you. we go. I feel like the universe is taunting me everywhere I go today. It all started with that bizarro dream in class. She's actually sleeping. <laughs> Am I going crazy? Have you ever fallen asleep in class? I don't think I have. I wanted to. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Fuck Aww. it. You can't just tear a Polaroid in half. When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. Ed restroom. It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You, you're okay, bro. Just count to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. What? You're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I oh, am God. or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down! Don't ever tell me what to do! I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs! Nobody would ever even people miss your punk hello. ass, would they? Get that gun away <gasps> from me, psycho! What? No! The hell? No way. <sighs> Whoa! She sees what the, the future. Fuck? How? How can that be? Hey, bro. I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. Yeah, I already heard I'm this lecture. I'm learning new stuff, too. From light to shadow. From color to Now shadow. Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings... This is real. She can stop. Now, Shit. Oh, can you give me an example different. of a Damn, photographer? I cannot the believe camera. this. The now she can't take a picture of black and white. Okay, if I'm crazy, Anybody? I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Can I actually reverse time? Go, oh, shoot. Why are give me the camera back. I did it. Can you give I me actually an did it. A photographer who perfectly captured I'm a human the human time machine. She's a human time machine. Anybody? Bueller? Max, don't oh, yeah. freak out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? Chrysalis. Why Arvis? Because of her Keep damn it. Everything is the same. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes. When I took my selfie, Jefferson asked me a question. She saw humanity as torture. If he does again, I'll know this is for real. Shh, 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 shh. Keep that to yourself. Seriously though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner. 
and capture you in a moment of desperation. And any one of you could do that to me. I believe Max has taken what you kids oh, call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max... Victoria's about to get gift. wrecked. I know I'm not dreaming this. You all know, the it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie expression. What if that girl so, isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point can I save that her? The portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography. For I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, <laughs> since you've captured oh, our right. interest and clearly Max. want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? I'm sorry, but I really have to use the bathroom. Nice try, Max. But you're not going to get away that easy. We can talk Max more after is class. In the is there extra anybody who at the end of before Jefferson the storm. wants to keep me after class. And I need time to save that girl. Types? A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. What, what if I rewind back? again? And give me a little use if you rewind. While rewinding, hold R2 to rewind faster. Max, since you've captured our I interest never, and clearly want to join the I conversation, the can you please yeah. tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? It underlines it for you. The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. <sighs> the Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular. Mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. Look you can learn more when you actually finish reading Look at these all our stuff chapters. all day now. Max is so far away. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? She hearts Seattle, say cheese. She doesn't need to be so effing mean. If he shoots me, I may not be able to reverse anything. The hell? This guy's gonna walk around possibly trying to shoot us every minute? Ahead of everyone. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. That's it's great exposure, again. and it can kickstart a career in photography. So I Stella Rachel, and Alyssa, get it together. Name. Taylor, hey, girl. don't hide. I'm Hi, still waiting Smelter. for your entry, too. And yes, How Max, you I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. She ends it's up time becoming... to be an everyday Wait hero. This doesn't make sense. Yes. Victoria, Who is she best friends with? Even Who is if you're Max submitting best your friends photo with? The competition, Rachel? I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. So far, so good, Smelter. I just started it maybe 20 minutes ago. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Uh, uh yeah, I'm not sure I have one. Given your selfie output, I'm sure you must have about so I guess a thousand picks by now. Mechanic It'll take a long time so you to find a good one. Max, dialogue. Don't right wait away. too long. John Lennon once said that I life is what that, happens but, while you're yeah. busy making other plans. Go on now. Don't let me you start. You never tried these games. It's kind of neat. It's different. Quickly undo your previous action. Mark on the gauge. Do your homework this week. Even if you're submitting your photo for the competition every- Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. I'm on top of it. 
I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. This is all the right answers. Good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. In social situations, the game, the video game. Cheating in social situations. Just rewind time and say what they wanted to hear. That's all you got to do. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. Why would I can't tell anybody. Science They'll think room. I'm crazy. Because Max wants everybody to see how hip she is. I guess there's a lot of stuff we could have explored, but we're not going to. We're gonna save the girl. Yo, Daniel. You know I don't I hate that science class with those nerves. Okay, Max, retrace every step. I washed my face. I shredded my photo. Then the butterfly flew in. And I took a photo. Nice. Okay, now what can we do? Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? You've played this? What are this? you doing? Come don't on, put that thing down. Tell me what to do. Wow, well, that's so one is free, so. Trying to control Even if you didn't me. play you the whole thing. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody. No, he has a gun. I should do something out. else. Get away from me, psycho! Oh. I need a hammer, a hammer. To open. No. no, 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 Damn it. Okay. I wonder how we'll get around this. All right. Don't. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying okay. to quick, control quick, me. Quick, quick, you are faster, going to get kid. Hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? No way. Don't. Touch me again, freak! Yeah, I've heard it's really good. So I'm pretty excited to check it out finally. Another finally. shitty day. That did not happen. Do you this think Life is Strange 2 is gonna be good? I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Do not freak out. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always <laughs> use that excuse. Oh yeah, this guy. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Jeez. Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Okay, can we go around exploring the school? <laughs> Probably not. Can we talk to him? You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm... I'm just a little worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You can always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max. He goes talk from to me. so nice to hide the truth. I just got sick in class. Um, uh, female trouble. Except you're wandering around like a zombie. Can we and do you make think that's the decision? first time a student has used that line on me? It's the truth. I felt dizzy in Mr. Jefferson's just class. Just tell me what you're hiding. You can trust me. There's nothing to hide. I got sick. I don't know. It happens, do they you know? do? There's that team too to get. I guess it you depends know, on if the I've school does an of. investigation. Don't think I don't know what goes on around here. You've only been here for three weeks and you're already causing conflict. I don't think your parents will approve when they find out. Now get outside with the class. Please. No, he does not buy that to at change all. The outcome. I may have just flushed my scholarship down the toilet. Yes, I could rewind and actually tell him the but... truth. You won't be able to undo your choices after leaving. Okay, let's see what you happens. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm, I'm, just a little worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking and about? And then what? You skip it. You could always be upfront with Make me. Make a choice. Report Nathan. 
I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott? You sure? Yes. He was in the bathroom He'll talking remember. to himself with a gun. Nathan Prescott with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now this you is, saw this they will remember without him seeing the you. Game. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right, I to, have be the right there. to be in it's the girls' the room. room. I know, I know. I just want to be completely Why is it clear cold what today? happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family and one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see oh him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. So what happened next? Then. then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you gonna bust him? This is a serious charge. At least he's aware I'll of look it. into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. Of course this academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family oh, yeah. owns Blackwell now. Should I rewind and change my story? I'll give you a chance to go back and change it again. Well, I, uh, stick with the truth, I guess. That way we don't remember where we've lied. I mean, just in case you don't remember. I don't know. Hi, Davin. It probably won't end up being that different. Speaking of games like this, I saw on Twitter that Telltale Games is closing down. With Nathan Prescott, uh -oh. come to the front Nathan's office. Nathan's busted. Searching for a gun. Okay, so what's gonna happen? Nathan's gonna think blue hair girl told. I would so be there if a Sasquatch actually did battle a Razorback. One, Warren. Can you get my flash drive? I need info. Running late. The camera will be ready. Hope so. Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab Let's that flash drive. Steal something from her bag. Leaving Seattle, we'll go back to Arcadia Bay. Mm, of all the best photography programs in the world, I choose to go the smallest back in the town I was excited about leaving. I always wanted to come back so I could play pirates. Oh yeah, Chloe, that's her name, Chloe. I wish Chloe moved to Seattle. Yes, they do play pirates. Stella always looks so serious and dedicated. Good for her. Hey there, Stella. Hey, I know you. You're the new quiet girl in Jefferson's class. Isn't he incredible? I think so. We're lucky to have such a famous teacher. And I actually love his work. Me too. His New York urban stuff is great, but Nobody I'm glad he came back to his organ roots. Their teachers. Screw the East Coast elite. It must piss off those pretentious galleries that Mark Jefferson is teaching photography to us Blackwell Hicks. Plus, he is pretty hot for an older guy. If Victoria wasn't all over him, I would definitely make oh. a move. What? <laughs> no way. You can get him so busted. And he's not going to mess around with a student. That's what uh -oh. you think. Now, how do you know this? You have a lot to learn here at Blackwell. Rachel Amber absolutely had sex with him. Well, I heard that from a good source. So, you knew Rachel? Not really. I saw her hanging with the other cool kids like Victoria. Not my kind of clique. But I heard insane stories about Rachel. Alrighty. Mr. Jefferson has such a gift for different styles. 
That's so cool that Blackwell is doing a show of Mr. Jefferson's work. What's up, Daniel? Oh, hi, Max. Could I, um, ask you a question? Would you mind letting me sketch you? I do put my sketches on Facebook, though. I'd be honored, Daniel. Makes me feel like a muse. Funny you should say that. I was just thinking about my real muse. Rachel Amber. So what happened to her? There's got to be a story. She just stopped coming to class. Some people said she ran away. Some say she jumped off a cliff. I just hope she's okay. You knew her? No, but once she asked okay, me to draw her portrait. Oh, she was a natural. Thanks for saying hi. Hard to avoid her posters all over campus. Kills me to see her sweet face used as a crime photo. Uh, she had a good heart. Okay, why don't you start drawing me? Even though I must be a step down from Rachel. No way, you're a good substitute muse. <laughs> substitute muse. Oh, that's a good posture. Good. Good. Best portrait ever. This action will have consequences. Dun, 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 dun. He's gonna draw a mustache on her and put it on Facebook. Uh, Max has a mustache. Clever. That's Luke Parker. Zach, uh, hello? Max, I don't feel like talking. What's wrong? Nathan Prescott, little rich bitch kid. He thinks he can own people like his parents own Blackwell. Like he owns the Vortex Club. Yes, he's a nasty piece Let's of work. Let's go teach him a lesson. You, you know him. I busted him. Not really. I've seen him around. Sounds like you know way more than that. Max, tell me. I busted him today with a gun. What? Seriously? I saw him wave a gun around today, and I went to the principal. We'll see what happens next. You are my new hero. Finally, karma comes to Blackwell. Well, we're just gonna tell everybody what's going on. I'm sure that'll go over well. I need to go there and grab her one's flash talk drive. To this guy. Evan. Evan's portfolio always looks so uber pro. I'd love to see his photo. Hey, Evan. <laughs> Mind if I check out your cool portfolio? Let's see if you're worthy of it, Max. You'll have to answer a simple question. Who photographed the famous fallen soldier? Uh, the famous falling soldier. We're gonna get it wrong and then we can rewind time and get it right. Um, obviously it was a guy named Kappa. Robert Kappa, of course. I love his work, despite the controversy about that photo. My, my. Oh, we got this quiet right. child knows things. That's why I'm here. You're a kindred spirit, Max. Would you care for a perusal of my portfolio? It's not a privilege I grant to many. I'd be honored, sir. <laughs> These photos are great. And Rachel Amber's face is mesmerizing. Mesmerizing face. I think everybody's a little, a little preoccupied with Rachel. Can't talk to you. Can we talk to you? Your teacher, Ms. Grant. Hi, Ms. Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Ms. Grant a favor and hear me out? 
Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance huh. cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, Bathrooms. gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. I guess cameras could have helped Rachel. I can see both sides. You're fair-minded, Max. And we all pray Rachel is found safe and sound, bless her soul. But this petition isn't about her. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage, from the Native Americans who founded this land to the pioneers who shared it in peace, not fear and violence. The Native Americans? The yeah, tribes the who were here head. first, who welcomed the settlers. Both cultures found a mutual symbiosis and thrived. Now, before I assign you homework with this lecture, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? Mm. Oh my gosh. I think they need the cameras, but it is sad. That is sad. Miss Grant, I totally respect your passion and knowledge, but some security cameras make me feel a little safer. I'm not against security, Max. We should all be concerned when private space becomes public. Yeah. Your generation has been tricked to think everything <laughs> should be recorded. And immediately put on the internet. <gasps> Consequences. Uh -oh. oh no. Friggin, what is that, a drone? Shoot it down. <laughs> I'm cold. I'm gonna go close the window. Come on, Logan, bring it, bro. Yeah. You wouldn't let your kid near that school. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. Hopefully, this isn't a timed mission. <laughs> If I told Warren what's going on, would he laugh? You're more on the teacher side? I generally am too. But after Rachel went missing and there's a freaking kid running around with a gun that the principal doesn't want to apprehend because his family owns Blackwell, maybe we do need it. I don't. The press that way, dormitory? if something happens, Nathan's family owns we're going to know. Dorm? The, the principal can't hide it. I always get a little giddy when I think about having my own room here. I didn't know about stuff like that in my... Feel differently. Oh. Hi, Max. How are you doing? Fantastic. I'm by myself Chiclet. reading Chiclet. Dude. Pretty soon I'll be bonding with It'll Victoria disappear. at the Vortex Club. I think you're better off reading Chiclet. Good point. Now, if you'll excuse me. Sorry. I really have to find out what happens. Hey, Logan Robertson. All-American asshole. No, bro. You can't take a picture. You gotta wait till Friday's game. No, bro. You can't take a picture. You gotta wait till Friday's game. Football, Max. Big football. Step away. Glad to see our campus is eco-friendly. Hi, Kate. Hey, Max. Nice, bro. You look down. You okay? I'm kind of over humanity today. Sorry to be a drama queen. 
Is there anything... Max, I'd like to be alone, if you don't mind. I'm sorry. Okay. Hey, Squirrely. He's having fun with his toy can. How cute. Make art, not war. Awesome. Howdy, Samuel. Well, hello there. What's up with these Rachel Amber posters? Well, only she would know that, right? Uh, I guess. It just makes the campus look sad. Thanks for you the can't color over that sunlight. Molten. Um. Nice, bro. You knew Rachel? How can you know a prison? You just stare in awe. Now I have to go paint windows. Oh yeah, he talks like this. Creepy. What do you think happened to her? Best not to dwell on the past. Samuel looks forward. Like a clock. What was she like? She must have been popular. Even sunlight can cast shadows. Rachel did both at once, you know. She was like a battery. Positive and negative. See you later, Samuel. Hi, Eagle. And watch your step around here, Max. After I sweep, nice, bro. I paint. All right. Get out of the way, girls. Oh, guys, Victoria. Oh, look, it's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe. The of selfie hoe. Oh, burn. What a lame gimmick. Even selfie Mark, ho. Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. Yeah. The Daguerrean processor. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> Why don't you call yourself Moist Fungus Apple? Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. No. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh, yes, Victoria. Actually, I'll get your bony ass I could out kick of my your way. ass, you know. That's the first and Damn last it, time I expect to hear us. that. Alright, we're gonna find some no. other way to kick grass. Yeah, with the sprinklers. Okay, now where exactly is the yes. sprinkler valve? Where is it? Isn't it? It's over here by the janitor. What the hell? Are you kidding? Look at this. Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Hey, Shreya. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. Can't even chill on the steps. Oh. Now she's gonna get paint on her, huh? Uh oh. Oh no, you were gonna accidentally drop some paint on you. What? What did it say, Victoria? Look. Alright, I guess we have to look at her to get the idea. She looks like a pissed off wet cat, and she's still stylish. Drop the paint. This, this game turns us mean. They're still in the way. Yeah. Uh, how do I? Can't focus on the. Pain. Oh. I must have missed something. Okay. I should rewind. Okay. What do we have to do? Push the. I 
don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. Hmm. A paint bucket next to Victoria. Tamper it. I see a plan. Okay, let's see if this works. Now what? Fast forward through time? <laughs> okay. Oh! What about- okay, so the sprinklers didn't work, that's the point. Can't we do sprinklers and paint? All right, let's get a nice view of this. Close, but no cigar. Right the they have to uh. be right under the bucket. What the hell? We do, we have to do both. Okay, let's see if this works. Yeah, choices matter, yeah. What the hell? To some extent. Are you kidding? Look at this! Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? Victoria. Oh, Samuel, sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair, no? Nope. Get sorry. the hell away from me, weirdo. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. Towel. We'll be right back. So move your ass before no. I drive. It worked. Don't mess with Max, well, bitches. Okay. So we're gonna be able to get by now? Oh, no, Victoria. You're all messed up. Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? I want Max? you to move. Comfort or make fun of her. Ah. I am sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was. But there'll be another. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's Don't one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. Are you gonna get? I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a Galloway. sign on me. You deserve a better shot. Sorry about blocking you and and the <laughs> go fuck your selfie. That was mean, but pretty funny. Just one of those days, you know. I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. I'll see you later. Au revoir. Victoria probably There's a lot of consequences. Room 217? No way in hell am I ever going in here. Go, Miss Grant. Not sure if Don't I will, let though. Big brother watch I'm a loser. You. Is, going to be is this a Vortex Victoria. Club or a Victoria Club initiation? As if. Juliet, extreme reporter. Dane is still a cheerleader at heart. I'd love to make a photo collage of. Man, people here are merciless. Looks like nobody won this TP war. There's nothing left but go. At least that's an alarm from this century. They live. Peace. <laughs> this is like the public DNA of our dorm.
Oh, Victoria, give me a fucking break. But what's this poster really trying to tell me? Warren should be all over Brooke. They're perfect for each other. Max's room. How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. We get it. She's missing. Somebody has gone crazy with these posters. Could be fun. Glad I'm not the only lonely nerd around here. I don't know, Shreya. Yeah, I don't think so. It's probably gonna be home something Home sweet else. home. My favorite cocoon. I'm glad Kate let me borrow her copy of the October. Instant film is so damn hard to find and expensive now. But I can't help it. I'm analog, not digital. You are thirsty. I'm the worst baby mama. Drink up. One day I'll organize my film collection. One day I'll get an actual HDTV. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. Philip Lorca de Corsha, my man. I don't think I could take my camera to those places. Look at that shot. I love Julia Cameron's Victorian vibe. Talk about analog cameras. Ah, oh, Dolly, what a fantastic eye. He could truly freeze time. Daniel, I am so addicted to this site. Look at Warren makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real Warren, friend gee. here. <laughs> That's the only tourist picture I let them take of me at the Space Needle. That was a good hockey game and a great fight. Man, Kristen and Fernando were so drunk hanging on the Fremont Troll. Cartier-Bresson, Doineau, Hamilton, the greatest. Hi, Indy. How are you? I like your new name. New account name. Oh, Max and Chloe. Best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. So cheesy, but it makes me smile thinking of the day Mom and I sewed that together. Ahoy, Captain. At least I know you've got my back. When I swallowed your eye and my parents rushed me to the ER, I knew we were bonded forever. <sighs> it feels so nice to just relax. This day has been so damn bizarre, and it feels like it has gone on forever. Maybe I'll just wake up now and find out I was dreaming all of this. Or sneeze. like Poe said, a dream within a dream. Maybe. Okay, maybe I'm okay. I love that mom sent me a fat box of chocolate coconut bites for my birthday. It's not exactly pretty in pink, but no shits are given. I like my wardrobe. Hard to believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit 18? into adulthood. Jeez, I thought these kids were in junior high. <laughs> Would Man Ray call them selfie portraits? The 
plant's name is Lisa. Your body gives you a split second. Do you sneeze all over your food, coin kid? I'll miss going to the games with my dad. Go Thunderbirds. I'm glad Kate let me borrow her copy of the October Country. I should have every bre- Looks like Dana left me a little poke. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rot in there. Is... Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. Her? Juliet, this is so stupid. Hey, Juliet, is everything cool? Oh yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. You are ridiculous. What did she do? What didn't she do? Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. <sighs> Ouch. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? You why are you even you. asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last and name? Juliet. Juliet. Um. Um. It's, uh. Mason. Juliet Mason. Uh. Juliet Mason. <laughs> that was truly sad. Thanks for your concern, Max Caulfield. By the way, Juliet Watson. Watch well, us get it right now. What do you think? Hey, Juliet. Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room. Um, um, what, what was her name again? What was it? Um. You are ridiculous. Juliet Watson, you be nice. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. Uh, of course I do. Thanks. I locked Dana in because she was sexting Zach, my boyfriend. Unbelievable. <laughs> Everything you be said to. Uh, how do you know? How do you know? Victoria Chase. You know her. You could say that. But why would Dana go after your boyfriend? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything uh -oh. to date a quarterback. According to Victoria? Victoria. Huh. She saw the sext, and Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Max, I swear I didn't do anything. Proof is in Victoria's room. <clears throat> Whose room is this? Room 217? No way in hell am I ever How going in I? here. Alright. <gasps> Maybe it'll let me in. There we go. Fungus. Now you're not going to be able to. T Dior, Givenchy, you could pay for my tuition with that wardrobe. Those boots are made for walking runways. I'm just going to call you Apple again. That is a tasty plasma. Maybe I could sneak in and watch Final Fantasy Spirits within. You should be. I don't care what anybody says. That's one of the best sci fi be, films um... ever made. You could be. What's the word? Moldy. You could be moldy, Apple. I bet Victoria put Juliet on her shit list after this article. Victoria hates Rachel Amber this much? How insecure. Victoria is a real Jefferson groupie. Laptop. I'll give Victoria props for not- Boom! This is the so email sick. I need to show Juliet. 
Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. Dumbass bully me, so expect there's a dorm rampage soon. Juliet deserves this for sliding Zack away from me. Oh, we had to print it. Print it! Hi, Badge! Thanks for saying hi. Hi, Strider. Okay, if I did wear expensive jewelry, I would wear this for sure. Yes, I get it. Enter the Vortex Club. No. Is she going to get a 3D printer for her dorm room? What the Maybe hell? Maybe I will join her posse. 3600 dollars. She's actually got a classic medium format camera with some awesome prime lens. Ouch. Well, at least she puts her photographs out there. Unlike me. Whoa, I had no idea Victoria's parents owned the chase space. Color me impressed. Mirror. Oh, photos. Oops. Can we go back in? Gallery letter. Oh, yeah. All right, let's look at the photos. Oh, we can mess them up. Let's mess up these photos. Let's play a little photo Tetris and leave Victoria a message. Let's move this here. And this one there. <laughs> hmm, a pattern is emerging. Check it out, look at this. I'm not letting her out until she tells the truth. Uh, how do we give her the proof? Leave me alone, Max. Get a clue. Dana's still a Can cheerleader at heart. Email did- oh, I didn't pick it up. Damn it. Keep three views. Okay, Cactus. You can do it. Alright, where did it print? Here. Yeah. Down the hall or something? Here. This better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. Juliet, read this. Of course. Let her out. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No. But I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zach has to say about Victoria. You set me free. <laughs> Thank you. That's what we do. Warren's flash drive Go is on my high desk. School, saving all the girls. Bye, never. See you later. Almost done. Get the flash drive and then I'll go see Warren. What have you got for us to look at? It would be a cool sticker without the words. This is both sad Dana, and Dana, I suck pathetic. at writing, but I thought I should write this so you might not hate my dumbass forever. I know I act like a tough jock around everybody, but I never had to act around you. I'm not the kind of man you deserve. You saw how I pissed out. If you need any money, let me know. Kiss, hug, Logan. 
Look, what else is there? Sticker. Pregnancy test. Take the pregnancy test. <laughs> what the heck? That looks okay, like guys, a pregnancy test. Okay, guys, do we take test. it or leave it? What do we do? Of course a popular cheerleader like Dana would have a million friends. It's so fascinating to get a peek into Dana's social... Must protect my precious so Max never has to chase it down again. Nice Smeagol cosplay. Max is messed Dana up. Dana takes her take black world spirit seriously. <laughs> I can't even imagine what life would be like right, being a cheerleader. It's ours. Dramatic, I guess. Oh, uh, Max, that's mine. Thank you. Oops. You're not helpful. You're just nosy. Damn it, we should talk to her first. I think you better first. go. No, I've never played this. This is nice. Max. I think this is you high school guys. By being so damn Bring in nosy pregnant again. kids in high school. No good. But I, I could said, rewind and make it go. up to her. We, there was a kid with a gun earlier, so it's high school. Max, enough. <laughs> damn it. There's no more gossip for you here, Max. Uh, so go. Yeah, there is. That's what you think. I got the power. <laughs> hey, Dana. Seriously, thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real mature. I heard a rumor about you. Can we say them all? Victoria is not nice. I don't get it. She has everything. And to pull that prank on a friend? Just because they're in the Vortex Club doesn't mean they're BFFs. I'm in it, and Victoria creeps me out. Max, you're smart to be a loner here. Though Warren obviously likes hanging with you. What do you mean? Oh, nothing. When you opened the flash drive, didn't you see the oh special folder called Max? Yeah, okay. She was I gotcha. Her special folder. Hey, Dana. Seriously, thanks again. Dana, I'm not trying to be nosy, but I heard a rumor about you. What? Who told you I was pregnant? Nobody important. They just acted like it was bullshit. I just wanted you to know. It's like a goddamn reality show around here. Can you keep a secret, Max? You're pregnant. Of course. I... Oh, no. Was pregnant. Was. Oh. What about the other... Deadbeat Dad? You can catch him on the 40-yard line this Friday. And it's not Zachary. Tell us who! <laughs> who, then? And you don't have to tell me. In fact, you better not. I like your spirit, Max. Anyway, you better get that flash drive so Warren has an excuse to bug you. I assume Dana kept the appointment. Oh, you maternity book. Good lord. Dana really was on her own. How to be a great baby mama. Oh my god. These kids. What, Lauren? Now what? You would not ask anyone any questions because it's rude. <laughs> I know, right? Certainly not in Welcome real life. Welcome to Black Hill. But they designed the game so that you're supposed to be nosy. Blackwell isn't that big, but it sure feels like a labyrinth. All right, let's go. You still enjoying your book? What the hell, dude? Fuck this shit! Ow! That hurt. Damn. <laughs> I better rewind. <laughs> All right, here we go. Doing our job of saving the girls. Oh, oops. Fuck this shit. Oh, oops. Fuck this shit. Oh, oops. Fuck this shit. 
Oh, oops. Fuck this I'm shit. sorry, guys. I keep slipping. Fuck this shit. Oh, I can't stretch time anymore. I feel like Alyssa and I should be better. Alyssa, okay, we're gonna wear. If you insist, Max. Oh no, we broke the window. <laughs> now that's what I'm talking about. I actually helped somebody. This will have consequences. No consequences Max, for accidentally awesome. slipping Thank on you. the ball earlier a few times. No problem. You have quick reflexes. Years of mad dodging skills. Well, these never change. That's why you're better off. You're smart. We should hang out more. Now I have to finish this stupid book. You okay, dude? Are you having a bad day? Get lost. Oh, here, this sir. is the one who I'm got he's mad interviews. because of uh, his girlfriend was pregnant. <laughs> Don't take it out on the tree, <laughs> loser. This is friggin' in drama. Drama school, oh my god. What are we, playing reality TV? All right, let's get out of here. <laughs> Hi, ghost. So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. You have to hug the tree? Take a photo or intervene? Well, we can probably do both, right? You can't fool me. I know everything about this school. I cover the waterfront. So you better figure out what side you're on. Please, Jeez, leave dude. me alone. Can't we take a picture and intervene? Nope. The heck? Hope you enjoyed the show. Thanks for You're nothing, welcome. Max. It will have consequences. Man, I should have stepped in between Kate and David. That Why asshole was so forever? over the line. There we go. I could rewind and try something different. Intervene. Hey, why don't you leave her alone? Excuse us, this is official campus business. Excuse me, you shouldn't be yelling at students or bullying them. Hey, hey, nobody is bullying anybody. I'm doing my job. No, you're not. You're part of the problem, Missy. I will remember He'll this remember conversation. That. Yeah, it was evident. Oh, Max, that was great. I think you scared him for once. I, I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Anytime, Is Kate. being drama? He's not even here, he's being drama, huh? I felt like an everyday hero helping Kate, but now Officer David Dickhead is after me. Alright. Maybe I should rewind and yeah, mind my own take business? A picture. Wait, what's going on? Oh, that's still Zachary. He was here earlier, maybe he's lurking. Bishtaka, show yourself. <laughs> Somebody say his name three times. Bishtaka, Bishtaka, Bishtaka. <laughs> Maybe he'll show up. <laughs> it worked, yeah. <laughs> there he is. Ta-da! <laughs> I'm glad I stepped in that time. Can't stand to see people being bullied. I don't get it. How could Zack and Victoria do that to me? I wonder how long before Samuel has to repaint that. What's the matter, Juliet? Watson. Hi, Juliet. How are you doing? <laughs> road oh, you. hey, Max. Sorry, <laughs> girls. I'm still screwed up. Sorry you had to find out about Zachary that way. <laughs> or anyway. Better sooner than later. Now that Skank Victoria won't be laughing. <laughs> thank you for the bags, Jonathan. Have you talked to Zach Cheers, yet? Thank you. Mr. Badass Football Hero is such a chicken shit. He said he sexed Victoria <gasps> as a joke. Oh chip. my god. Ha ha. 
I think Warren wants your attention. He usually does. Hang in there, Juliet. See you around, Max. He usually does. Oh, nice drawing. There's some good art at this school. Cars equals death. Good thing I don't have a car. Yeah, I mean, since yet. they equal death. What is our trophy for reading every missing person poster in the school? Looks peaceful asleep, but if I get too close, Kuja time. Kujo. It's not a dirty window unless somebody writes "clean me" on it. This will have consequences. I could use this picture for a series on Arcadia Bay Lodge. I'm so dirty. <laughs> In a minute. Please. All right. What's up, Warren G? And there's Warren. Did he actually buy a used car? What up, Max? How are you? Bishop Flash. <laughs> Thanks. No problem. Hi, Tomatin. Check out my new wheels. Cool. Tomatin. Very old school. 1978 to be exact. Now we can go to the drive-in. There's one in How'd Newburgh just 60 wrong? miles away. You're in the wrong time, Warren. But then, so am I. You okay? It's been one strange fucking day. Watch your mouth, I young bet. lady. I heard Victoria got a face full of paint. I'd pay money to see a photo of that. To see a photo of what? Really? I wish I would have known. You probably could have raised a Kickstarter fund just for that one okay. image of her covered in paint. Had I known that. Anyway, Victoria took down my photo, so that drama ended well. By the way, I saw Daniel's sketch of you online. Not bad, but I could do a much better job. You can draw? I thought you were blinded by science, not art. Art is science. Music is math, etc., etc. I'd put Stephen Hawking against Picasso any day. Hardcore. Uh, so you must could use, we a have used a computer to, draw. to look at the. Of course. I'd love to tweak one of your selfies with some cool USB graphics. Drive? That might not suck. I'll let you know. So, did you get a chance to check out the movie booty on my flash no. drive? Shoot. We missed it. No, I've been way too busy with class and life. Damn, girl, you had it like a year. For a week, I did browse through all the titles, Drama Queen. Ha ha. Make sure you watch Cannibal Holocaust. <laughs> no fucking way will I watch that. My mind is twisted enough. I laughed my ass off. So you're sensitive. Ouch, that sounds that awful the way the you say it. Leaves? No, I was impressed you had faster pussycat kill kill. Russ Mayer was a genius of black and white. Plus, babes with breasts. Who would beat your sensitive ass down? If I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. But you seem distracted. I need to talk to somebody. Just to get it out of my system. Dr. Oh, no, Warren Max. Graham is in the what house. A mouth. I won't even prescribe you any meds. Tell me everything. Okay, well, first of all. For reals, Warren, this is between you and me, not social media. Don't insult me. Oh, Max, great. Go on. I had this incredibly bizarro experience in Mr. Jefferson's class today. I mean, life changing. Have you ever had a dream so real it was like a movie? 
We're gonna get in. Max Caulfield, right? You're one of the Jefferson's photo groupies? I'm one of his students. What the fuck ever? I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You best tell me what you told the principal now. Answer me, bitch. I told him the truth. A student had a gun. No, you told him I had a gun. That's why he dragged me into his office. And did what? Give you a stern lecture? Nobody. Nobody lectures me. Everyone tries, though. <laughs> they try. You should talk to somebody, Nathan. Do not analyze me! I pay people for that. Worry about yourself, Max Caulfield. Mm. Where's the punch him in the face button? I could call the police. Do it! The Prescotts own the pigs here. Get away from her, dude! Uh. Hey! Leave him alone! Nobody tells me what to do! Not my parents, not the principal, that. or that whore Wait, in the bathroom! No. Oh, shoot. <gasps> Max? Chloe? No way. You again. Oh, oh, bro, I got oh you. my god. <laughs> Get we found the punch him in the face button, guys. Get your punk asses out of there now! Don't even try to run! Nobody! Nobody! Oh my god. I hit five cars in the parking lot like that. Man, was, Nathan was Prescott that? is messed up and dangerous. This day never ends. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. Don't give me the guilty face. At least pretend you're glad to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Yes, it's been that kind of day. So what did that freak want with you? Hopefully nothing after today. So, how do you know Nathan? He's just another Arcadia asshole. Your friend really took a beat down for you. Warren? Yeah, I owe him big time. You're not the only one in debt. And you're already causing trouble. I thought it would be quiet here. It feels so weird to be back. So I guess Seattle sucked hard? I guess. It was cool, but I felt kind of lonely, out of my league. I would think you'd fit right in with the art school hipsters. Right. You look like the cover of hipstergirl.com. At least you're still a smartass. That's why I'm here. Please, girl. You came back for Blackwell Academy. Only for Mark Jefferson. He was a pretty famous photographer in the 90s. I've always loved his work. Those that can't do, teach. I'm glad you found a good reason to come back. Don't you think I'm happy to see you? No. You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. Time Spinner. I haven't even heard of that game. Is that another Switch game? I'm sorry. I know things were tough on you when I left. How do you know? You weren't even here. I didn't order my parents to move specifically to fuck you over, Chloe. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. Enough said. I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliche geek. I totally would have contacted you. I bet you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. Don't use them on me, Max. Two D Castlevania style. A lot of those coming out now, huh? What? It broke again? Broken? Ugh. Man, are you serious? Wow, haven't heard that one in a while. <laughs> Not everything changes. Except my camera has officially taken a shit. My step douche has a boatload of tools. Maybe you can fix it at my place. I need very specific tiny tools. Bird alert. My stepdad has a fully stocked garage. And he actually is a tiny tool. Welcome home, Max. She was funny and before the storm.
Come on in. Don't be shy. The house still looks nice. Home, shit, home. Think like a man. My room looks a bit different than the last time you saw it. It's cool. At least we can chill out. This isn't exactly my chill out zone. My step fear makes sure of that. Come in and close the door. Put on some music while I medicate. It won't play without any power. Hey, that TV used to be in the living room. Houston, we have the power, but we need to find a disc to play. Look at that. Chloe and her dad were so close. We had such a blast drawing these together. Another thing we could do. Lots of things. This postcard is from Rachel Ember. And it reeks like dirty laundry. Gross. Old cardboard boxes. Oh, this is a flashback to youth. Our super secret closet lair. Chloe totally changed her style. I barely Bye, recognized Jonathan. her. See you later. Chloe was always taller than me. We made her dad keep track of her height. Nothing but junk in this suitcase. Where's your CDs, girl? Voila. Rachel. Hey, give me that. Sorry, I wasn't trying to be nosy. I wasn't trying. Obviously, she was a good friend. It's putting it mildly. That's Rachel Amber. Her missing person posters are all over Blackwell. Yeah, I put them up. She was my angel. After my dad died and you moved, I felt abandoned. Rachel saved my life. Man, I had no idea. Well, you never made much effort to find out. I was 14. We were best friends. I never forgot. Even if I was an asshole and didn't keep in touch. But you had Rachel. Rachel had my back. We were gonna kick the world's ass. You would laugh at how different we were. She wanted to be a star. She looks like a model. That was her plan. Our plan. Get the hell out of Bigfootville and into Los Angeles. So what happened? Did your folks, your mom, try to stop you? My mom was too busy hooked up with Sergeant Shithead. I feel the love. Now, when did Rachel actually disappear? Six months ago. She just left Arcadia. Without a word. Without me. But... How do you know she disappeared? Maybe she wanted to start a totally new life. Unlike you, she would have told me, okay? Something happened to her. I believe you. I'm just trying to get all deductive. 
Before Rachel left, she said she met somebody who changed her life. And poof. And you haven't heard anything from her since? Like everybody in my life. My dad, you, and Rachel. Gone. Can you put on some music now? I think we weren't able to say, ask her one other thing. Who'd have thought Chloe wouldn't pay her parking tickets? She does love trouble. So it was Chloe who printed all those flyers. Is this a desk or a storage space? Alright, let's put on some music and then maybe... We can... Oh, we don't have the hard drive or the thumb drive anymore. Anyway, you can find tools to fix your camera in the garage. Chloe, are you okay? Sure, I'm awesome. I just want to blaze and be alone for a moment. She looks super happy. She looks super sad. She looks super stoned. Damn, Chloe does need a lot of money to get out of Arcadia. I'm not into them. Too pretentious. Is that supposed to be a jewel? Whoa, dark. I cannot see... Anything. I wonder if Chloe is taking those pills. I hope she's okay. So many emotions. I like Chloe's new hair color. She's the opposite of shy. Of me. This is definitely Joyce's makeup. Chloe wouldn't use animal products. Amazing stories found in the bathroom. What will we find out about next? You can't go home again, said Thomas Wolfe. But here I am. These books have not been touched since the last decade. Hi, Ellie. I see why. Oh no. Oh. oh my god. This must be Chloe's parents' room. Man, I'm nosy today. Oh. Oh shit. Poor thing. I bet I could do we something safe. Probably just passed it. out, right? Close the window. <laughs> Dog tags, sweet. David Matson. Act, react, or die, a 21st century survival guide. Whoa, apocalypse self-help. Oh Hi, my. Ren. Chloe made this for Joyce on yeah, Mother's Day years too. ago. I see why she would keep it. We did, we did it. Joyce still works at the diner and Chloe's new dad is a security guard. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh, yeah, rewind. The prices are late on their bills. All right, we'll rewind. You still get credit for looking at all this stuff, right? I'm sure you do. Joyce looks happy. Chloe's stepdad might we'll not be a douchebag after all. Before the bird hits it. Mm. 
Joyce always loved her mail order catalogs of useless crap. Aww. Joyce has a little shrine to William. Her new husband may not be such a douche. Yay, no TMI stuff in the drawers this time. You've been resurrected, Birdie. Fly, Free be free. Close it. Oh no. Will he die in here? Okay, maybe he can get out again. I hope. Oh. Did I just skip uh, something important? I don't know. Why would we be able to skip? Just skip looking around or something. Hi, Tronsta. Oh my gosh. I have not been sleeping well. I'm feeling kind of crazy. I guess it's early enough I could get more coffee. Is it early enough? Twelve forty five. Twelve forty five already. Yeah. We gotta snoop at this mail. Doesn't look like the Price right, family is rolling snooped. in dough these days. Okay, thoroughly snooped. You neither, Eagle? Now this is the Chloe I remember. Always smiling and laughing. Not so much anymore. I haven't seen this place in five years. Seems like forever. Joy still works at Two Wells Diner. Best damn burgers in Arcadia. Toilet I better get one soon. Open the window. Anyone else buffering? Hi, Spigaloo. Hey, I remember that stain. Chloe and I knocked over Joyce's wine bottle and we scrubbed forever, but it never came out. We got so busted. If I took this picture, the deer would be standing on your ass. Damn, it's the couch. We used to pretend it was a pirate ship. Looks like a ship wreck now. Garage. I guess they're aging these books. Chloe, if you're listening, Pete was cruising home off duty and told me he saw you near that garbage dump. Now I've ordered, told you, to stay away from that place. It's dangerous. I finished no the story school. If, if nope. there's time, someone locked it from the other side. Online. This is a great streaming game. That's good to know. I should be able to find the tools I need here. Chloe's stepdad is head of security at Blackwell. He wants to put surveillance cameras all over the school. Yeah, How I was so happy can you get? I finally finished it.
Chloe's stepfather is this asshole from Blackwell? You've got to be shitting me. Uh-oh. Hmm. One of these guns is missing. I hope Chloe's stepdad isn't packing heat. Yes, score. This will have consequences. What the? Chloe's stepdad actually installed cameras in the room? We better go tell For Chloe. Reals? What? This guy has serious trust issues. Do Chloe and Joyce oh, even know quiet? about this? I wasn't trying to be. Could turn down. Turn it down a bit more. Let me know how that is. She turned it off. These are way too big. I need tiny tools for that camera. Tiny tools. No password. Like it would help me find tools anyway. Sounds good. The way it was before or after, now that I've changed it. How is it now? Still good? Shit! Butterfingers! Uh -oh. Consequences! Kate Marsh? Why the hell would he have pictures she of her? She knows something. Okay, this is getting what? totally weird. Uh-oh. Oh, nothing. Okay. This is so really lame. Look at all that food. That's like enough spam for a hundred years. Yesterday, people were saying my voice is too low, Spoogaloo. I guess it could depend on what you're listening with, though. If you're listening with speakers, it could be different than if you're listening with a headset. Cool. Now it's open. Life is strange. Pretty well, Mahatma. How are you doing? Check out the muscle car. Chloe's stepdad must be a geek. I am a little farther from the mic than I usually am. Where are these tiny tools? <laughs> Poor little deer. It's not enough to kill you. They have to display your head. Oh, speakers. Yeah, I might be a bit quiet. Nothing. This is so lame. <laughs> Where are you? Tiny tools. All right, we're gonna go tell Chloe about the friggin' cameras in the house. Creepy. Sliding door. We're free. Brr. I can feel Autumn pushing out to summer. William used to grill awesome burgers for us. I wonder if A he was grave. the last one to use this. Aww. We made this grave for Chloe's Poor kitty. Poor Bongo. Poor Bongo. He never saw that car coming. That took Chloe and me the whole day to draw. It's almost invisible now. Oh, I loved this swing. William made it just for me and Chloe. The broadcast is it. <laughs> Can 
Yum, that looks tasty. I do miss Joyce's cooking. We looked at that, right? Joyce still works at Two Wells Diner. Best damn burgers in Arcadia. I better get one soon. Precision screwdrivers. Except turn it I on. can't reach them. It'll make them fall. They're just like on the edge like that. That was very smart, dumbass. No can reach. Oh, yeah. There was something we could use to reach. No? I want him to know. <laughs> oh, there's a map. <gasps> Placement of cameras. Wowzer, a map of Blackwell Academy. I wonder why. I want him to know, Shreya. We're, we have to make drama. I thought there was something we could use. That does not look stable. Boom, precision screwdriver. Maybe what Except was there something I in the can't backyard? Reach them. Okay, let's go see. It's so tranquil here. Like a Japanese garden in Oregon. We can use the swing. Oh. Well, was that something? Oh. oh, conversation. What do you truly want to do when you grow up? Just jump. Max, I'm already grown up. What about you? Travel. That would be awesome. Explore the world, go far from here. I'm gonna get some coffee. Far from me? Thanks a lot, dude. Dude, you would totally come with me. I need a bodyguard for our adventures. I would be like, like Lara, Lara Croft, Croft, except real. I think that this is our conversation cool. they had while playing totally. pirates. We'd have cars and boats and planes all over for instant escape. And no adults could tell us what to do. Count me in. What would you do while I was bodyguarding you? Maybe take pictures of our adventures. I would love to be a photographer. As if I ever could be. What are you talking about? Max, you are a photographer. Your pictures could be in a museum. Someday they will. I believe in you.
Did anyone invade my game and kill me? Hmm. One of these guns is missing. I hope Chloe's stepdad isn't packing heat. Oh, there we go. Very odd puzzle solving, but we got it. It's popcorn eagle. Yes, you have okay, mad skills, Max. I've got okay. the tools. I should go back upstairs before Chloe freaks. Yeah, I thought it was kind of weird too. <laughs> But I guess they wanted to be creative. I guess my Elgato is not dying. It looks like the problem was my computer is dying. You found Thank the tools. Thank you. Sweet. You can sit at my desk and fix your camera. You like popcorn? So? I can't fix this thing. Are these your new photos? Yeah. I just took them today. Let me see. Wait. I've seen this before. Uh, no way. When did you take this? You took this photo, you brat? In the bathroom today. You set off the alarm. That's why Nathan raged after you. It totally makes sense. You hella saved my life. Why wouldn't you? Now tell she me the truth, Max. The truth. I was there. 
hiding in the corner. Damn, you're a ninja. A ninja would have cut Nathan's head off. I just took a butterfly photo. That is so badass. Oh yeah, I almost wet myself when I saw the gun. Mm. So, did you recognize me? Actually, she didn't. That's why. I wonder- Not at all. Your hair and clothes are so different. I hope so. I'm sure this is all so weird to you after coming back. Like you said, it's been that kind of day. So you must have overheard our conversation. <laughs> Just a bit. There is no way you didn't hear every single vowel. Okay, I money, only heard drugs, something about rock and money, roll. drugs, but that's it. Now for the big question. Did you tell anybody? Absolutely. Nathan Prescott had a fucking gun on you. Gutless prick. That was scary. Who did you tell? The principal. <laughs> but he didn't seem to believe me. The principal? Are you still 12? I that drunk jackass right only guy. cares He's about cash from Blackwell Academy. Don't trust him. I didn't mention you at all. Swear. Thank God. I'll tell you more someday. And I seriously owe you, Max. I, uh, know it was your birthday last month. This was my real father's camera. I want you to have it. That's so cool you remembered my birthday, but I can't take this. Of course you can. My dad would be pissed if I never used it, and now I know it'll be used awesomely. And I'll snag this picture as a symbol of the our butterfly union. butterfly picture? Cool? Yes, of course it's cool. Thank you. This camera is so sweet. Now that we got that mushy shit out of the way, I feel like stage diving. Let's thrash this place. You're crazy. Yep, yep, I'm fucking insane in the brain. Let's dance. Shake that bony white ass. Or take my picture with your new camera. <laughs> take a picture. This day couldn't get any stranger. It's all right, Shrey. I still gotta fix it, but it's okay. This song fucking rules. Can't dance, hippie? Come on. Time Knock to dance, girl. Just dance stream. Yes, break it down, Max. Yo, turn it off. Turn it off. How many times have I told you to stop blasting that punk shit? Dude, the music's not even on. Asshole. I'm coming up. We need to talk. Oh, no fucking way. You need to hide now. My stepdad will kill me if he finds you here. Is it time to tell her? Tell her. Chill, I'm changing. Is that okay? Max, find a place to hide now. Chloe. I'm coming. What are you doing? Chloe, you're stalling. I'm changing. Give me a minute. Don't get smart. <laughs> Let me in now. What? Please. One second. My bra is stuck. I'm not screwing around, soldier. Chloe, open this door. I'm not a kid anymore. I can't hide under the bed. Where else? What? I'm giving you Where exactly three seconds to open the door. One, two, three. This is this is going nowhere fast. I better look What's someplace else. Why is she here? None of your business. I don't like strangers here. Stop freaking. She's not a stranger. This is my friend. Great. There's no one to hide. Friends. I ordered you to never go through my files. You obviously have. Oh, I didn't touch your files, David. I could care less about your files. You care about starting shit, Chloe, and it's getting old. <laughs> One of my guns is missing. Did you take it? Oh, God, I didn't take your stupid gun. You do know I believe in gun control? Wait, is that grass? You been token up again in here? Oh, yeah, guns, weed. You were tripping balls. I'm sick of your disrespect. Tell me the truth. That's an order. It's not my pot. It's what? from Max. Is this true? Uh, yeah. My pot. So you're bringing drugs into my home. How about if I call the police? That'd screw up your spotless Blackwell record. 
You do seem to get around, what? Max. I'm sick of you losers dragging Chloe down. Missy, you sure do like to pop up and start trouble. Like this afternoon. You don't have anything smart to say now, do get you? Get the hell away from huh? her, man. Stop harassing my friends. You don't have any friends. Like you know. You're not even a real cop. You're a fucking security guard. I was a soldier, Chloe. And Max, if I see you here again, you'll learn all about real trouble. Thanks for taking the heat. We totally smacked his punk ass down, Max. He's no match for you and me now. That was an epic win. Anyway, let's sneak out the window. There is one cool place we can hang in this hickle. Oh. Man, that did not go well for me. If I want to keep my Blackwell scholarship, I shouldn't lie for anybody, even Chloe. What? I have to think about my own they future. They want us to go back and... Say it was Chloe? Hell no. That guy just better not tell anybody. Everyone lies. <laughs> Everyone poops. Reminds me of when we were kids. Come on, slow poke. Hold on. I haven't been here in forever. So why do I feel like I was just Yeah, I figured here? we'll just shoot that guy. Whoa. This is the exact same path I was on uh -oh. during my nightmare today. Oh yeah. I feel like I'm in my nightmare again. Bird. Birds are so lucky, they can always escape. Oh my god, I forgot BFF all about pirates. this. pirates. Too bad I can't rewind that far back. I don't remember this at all, but it seems like it's been here for a long time. Wowzer, Chloe drew that to mm -hmm. mark our tree for it, so we'd always be able to find each other in case of emergency. <sighs> Looks like the youth of Arcadia Bay still come up here to party. I never made it. Turn. A tree haiku? Turn this way now and face the lonely autumn tree and never look back. A tree haiku? How pretty. Those sure aren't big feet. What kind of animal left those prints? Weird. Those glyphs remind me of the wind. Clearly, the Bigfoots are everywhere. How long has that been here? Too bad it's locked. I remember racing up and down the steps. Where did she go? I thought she went to the lighthouse. Oh. This would be a nice photo of Chloe, framed by the sun. Take a picture.
You sure you don't want to be alone? Have a seat, Pete. <laughs> You're, You're in a bad good mood. Seeing my step dork get played makes me happy. I'm not as brave as you. And David is indeed a step douche. I'm sorry you had to experience it firsthand. You have to live with him. Has he always been this way? Ever since my desperate mom dragged his ass to our home, I never trusted David. Hmm. He freaked out on poor Kate Marsh today. I know her. She's cool. Only that prick would bully her. Throw her down he has the cliff. some kind of weird agenda. He has a lot of secret files. Rambo still thinks he's gathering enemy intelligence. Did you take a peek? Well, yeah, I couldn't help it. Never change. What did you find? Creepy photos of Kate Marsh. Other Blackwall students. This dude takes his job too seriously. He still thinks he's at war or something. He's a total surveillance fetish. Where are there spy cams in the house? I knew you didn't know. My sister Chloe, had a reschedule. Your house is under surveillance. What Jason wasn't going to be there. <laughs> there are cameras all over the house. I saw it on a monitor in the garage. I knew it. He's so hella fucking paranoid. I'll keep this a secret for now. Sometimes ignorance is bliss. No wonder I'm so miserable. Everybody in this town everybody knows everybody's secrets. secrets. Even yours? Not anymore. So what do you have on Nathan? What? He's an elite asshole who sells bad shit cut with laxatives. What? And he dosed me with some drug in his room. What? I met him in some shithole bar that didn't card me. Huh? He was too rich for the place and too wasted, and he kept flashing bills. Just tell me what happened, Chloe. Now. I was an idiot. I thought he was so blazed it would be an easy score. You needed money that bad? Actually, yes. I owe big time. And I thought I'd have enough for me and Rachel if she showed up. Well, what the hell? How much do you owe? Three grand plus interest. And before I could get a chunk of that from Nathan, he dosed my drink with some shit. God, Chloe, I can't believe this. I mean, I do. Then what? I know I passed out on the floor. Oh I my woke God. up and that perv was smiling, crawling towards me with a camera. Go on. Everything was a blur. I tried to kick him in the balls and broke a lamp. Nathan freaked, so I managed to bum rush the door and get the hell out. <sighs> no, I got the idea because my sister was supposed to come over. And I was just trying to figure out what kind of stream we could do. But she couldn't make it, after all. That's like her biggest thing that she does. Yoga. And she makes dream catchers too. I'm furious. Let's get revenge. I am so furious, I can't even speak. What did you do then? I figured I would make him pay me to keep quiet. So we met in the bathroom. And he No, she was gone. in the stream, but that she was, was gonna Nathan's come over and we were mistake. gonna do a stream together. Let's call the police. What are you going to do? Pop a cap in his ass? Let's call the police. Screw that. You already told the principal, and I'm sure it's useless. I won't always be there to save you. You were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like... Destiny. Hi, Imperator. If this is destiny, I hope we can find Rachel. I miss her, Max. This shit pit has taken away everyone I've ever loved. I'd like to drop a bomb on Arcadia Bay and turn it to fucking glass. Uh-oh. What? Prince. 
Yes. Doing pretty well. How are you? <gasps> Is Chloe still up there? I have to find out. Still? I was supposed to hurry. I've never seen a storm like this in Oregon. Go the other way. Oh, ahead of time to teleport yourself. What? Oh, okay. Because she'll still be in the same spot. Okay. Joe is trying to get us killed. Until dawn. <laughs> yeah, I know it's like that. Oh my god. Oh my lord! The tornado is back! What? Straight for the town. Chloe, you're here. I'm back. Oh my lord, this is real. It's real. Oh man, this sucks. Tornadoes? What's going on? You totally blacked like your out. analysis. I didn't black out. I had another vision. The town is going to get wiped out by a tornado. Oregon gets about five tornadoes every 20 years. You just saw it. No, no, I saw it. I could actually feel the electricity in the air. Come on, take a breath, okay? Chloe, I'm not crazy. But there's something else I have to tell you. Something hardcore. Talk Would to you me, believe Max. your friend? I had the same vision earlier in class. When I came out of it, I discovered I could reverse time. Like I said, not crazy. But I 
out, right? Listen to me. How do you think I saved you in the bathroom? By reversing time? Yeah, sure. I saw you get shot, Chloe. Saw you <laughs> actually die. I was able to go back and hit the fire alarm. Okay, I see you're a geek now with a great imagination, but this isn't anime. I hope everyone's surviving the hurricanes. Don't have okay. Those powers, Max. I don't know what I have, but I have. Looks it. like there's some pretty scary and I'm pictures. Scared shitless. You need to get hot. All that it's blood in the hell insane fucking day. What the hell is this? Snowflakes. It's like 80 degrees. How? Climate change. Or a storm is coming. She believes her now. Max, start from the beginning. Tell me everything. Hi, Annie. I like your name. She's like a mutant. I uh, guess. <laughs> Bitches. <laughs> oh, is that the end of episode one? You're meant to be in this chat. <laughs> Bro will be so jelly. Bishtaka, bishtaka, bishtaka. <laughs> first episode we're in a stream at least probably two and a half episodes today oh there we go that, that was the end of episode one <laughs> bitch summoning bitch taco only works once a day yeah i guess you're right bitch taco all right episode one is done <laughs> Hope you enjoyed episode one, Life is Strange. Playing this game in prep for Life is Strange 2, which should be coming out in a few days. I should be able to get it from Square Enix. That should be a stream. Your name doesn't work? Sure it does. Your name would be Oh My Bish. <laughs> Hopefully episode two is downloaded. Should we just let's just do the credits at the end of the game? Alright, Chrysalis. You reported Nathan, just like 65%. You comforted Victoria, like 66%. You intervened to help Kate, 82%. You took the blame for Chloe, 32%. Oh, you, you can actually hide. Oh, Stay hidden. Come out of hiding to intervene. I like taking the blame for Chloe. We're here to save the girls. You pre-ordered. Nice. You let Daniel draw your portrait. Most of them don't let Daniel draw the portrait. Why not? Most don't sign the petition. Most help Alyssa. Oh, most don't erase Kate's slate. I erase the insults on Kate's, Kate's slate. Water the plant. Didn't touch Dana's pregnancy test. Reorganize Victoria's I. I reorganized Victoria's photos. Most people didn't. Most people didn't see it, probably. Most people did not write on a dirty RV. We, we saved the bird. Most people didn't. Didn't break Chloe's snow globe. I left evidence while searching through David's stuff. Yeah, I wanted him to know. <laughs> Most people don't do that. 
And most people read David's files. Nice. Episode 2 is ready. I hope. It's out tonight? Are you serious? I don't think I'll be getting it tonight. Out of time. I know you now. Join in the conversation. It says purchase still. Why, why, why? Continue. Not installed. Yeah, it should be. Hold on. 